The new Spokane County Jail may be coming in the near future. And there's a spot that the county is hoping to relocate Geiger Corrections Facility to. It would also save taxpayers money. KXY4's Ian Cole joins us now live with how the state or that site is a win-win. Well, Sheriff Knezovich says that this is not a done deal quite yet, but he says that if this site is picked for the site of the new jail, which is basically between South Geiger Boulevard and Spotted Road, it's going to make a lot of people happy. It doesn't look like much, just an open field of uneven ground. But County Sheriff Ozzy Knezovich envisions that this would be a good place to lock down criminals. We're trying to work with the community, make sure that this is a good fit for wherever it's built. The site along Geiger Boulevard is actually owned by the airport, but wasn't talked about as a potential site until five months ago. Sheriff Knezovich says that the jail would cost around $199 million to build. But since the jail would be next to the waste energy plant, the steam could be used to lower operations cost. And no roads would have to be rerouted, saving another $5 million. Knezovich says most importantly, the current facility is outdated, overcrowded, and recently... They have to deal with escape attempts. They have to deal with uh, things, uh, contraband coming into the facility. Recently, there's been three escape attempts and one successful escape just Saturday, where police are still looking for prolific car prowler Nathan Calvert. We're doing everything in our, our power to make sure that that does not happen. But uh, again, when you're dealing with a facility that's not never been designed to be a jail, it makes it very difficult. Other sites mentioned for a new Geiger facility include an area near Craig and McFarland. All of them drew criticism for being too visible and too close to businesses and homes. But this location isn't any of those, according to Knezovich. It's just right. This is uh, a win-win for the public in reference to the siting location. Uh, Knezovich is working with county commissioners to get a bond on the ballot that would help pay for this facility. He also says that another way they can save money is that the airport and county may trade land as opposed to the county simply just paying for it. Ian Cole, KXLY4 HG News.